Welcome back. I'm still in conversation with Sri Sri Ravi Shankar, the founder of the Art of Living movement. Uh, Sri Sri, lately, yeah, you are in a new avatar, giving sleepless nights to multinationals. Uh, you are into your Ayurvedic line of products. About 1,000 or more retail outlets going to come up all across India. Uh, can you tell us a little bit more? What are you planning? Why you know, did you do this? You know, actually, I'm not directly involved uh, in any of these um, initiatives okay. of Ayurveda. Mm -hmm. I do, in my name, I do encourage our young people yeah. who are very enthusiastic in uh, giving quality products to the world. Mm -hmm. We have been doing this for a long time, but I know. we were doing it only uh, in a small uh, way, you know, that but now the demand for the quality product is so high, so uh, our young people uh, are uh, coming forward to expand the whole business. Mm -hmm. I've said okay to them, yeah, they can go ahead with that. That's is that just that? I mean, because apart from the see, it gives employment to hundreds yeah. and thousands. No, no, no of doubt about that. But because this employment is uh, rate has fallen down today. You know, the unemployment is rising. And in one sense, it gives employment to people. Number two, it gives quality products to people. Third is uh, natural resources are are being increased. We increase people to grow organic food. Yeah, and good food is essential today. Apart from the multinationals who are going to have, I'm sure, sleepless nights, you are also going to give tough competitions to a brand which is already established. That is Patanjali. So, no, see, the, I don't see there is any competition here. There is, uh, it's such a huge field. There is yeah. place for everyone to play. In fact, we are also multinational. You know, we are Absolutely. in 155 countries, and from everywhere, people today are, uh, uh, you know, recognizing the value of Ayurveda and uh, the goodness of yoga and Ayurveda. You know, Ayurveda yoga have always gone together from ancient times. The rishis who gave yoga, they themselves also gave for, you know, Ayurveda as well. So we continue in the same tradition. Nothing you new. You continue in the same tradition. <laughs> now, Northeast, are we going to see some, uh, you know, that your new initiative expansion into the Northeast? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are doing what a are lot doing? of Are skills. you manufacturing here? What are you doing? Yeah, of course, we have uh, our main thing is education. We have started many schools here. We already ran 78 free schools all over North 78? Yes, correct. Okay. At and what level been, of are these schools actually? Yeah, from primary to high school uh, to, uh, you know, SSLC. Yeah. So. Uh, schools we are running. And then we are running the skill, skill development training centers. Uh, you know, Northeast has a lot of human resource development. And we are also planning many food uh, processing units in this area. And uh, Ayurvedic college is something that's on, uh, on the cards. On the cards. Okay. We want to create an Ayurvedic college and therapy training centers because Northeast youths are the most brilliant uh, therapist that we have seen. They have the skill. They they know how to you know work with their hands. So um, we are into all this. Uh, you know. So at the end, uh, Guruji, I mean, like this mission has been for this. Northeast Indigenous Peoples Conference, which you have uh, done, uh, you know, it's a great initiative to bring people together, which has been a difficult task. People with different ideologies and, you know, militant groups and all. Now, having done that, what is the message? Because at the end of the day, as I said before in my previous question to you, at the end of the day, it is the government that has to come up with the initiative where people like you can play the role of a catalyst or peacemaker, uh, peacenik, uh, if I may use the word. Uh, what Messages are you going to give see, to the government of India after any, going back? See, for any project to be successful, you need the four pillars of our society come together. It's uh, the media, it's the business and the industry, right. uh, the government, and the faith-based or NGOs who can become the mediator, who can uh, stitch the torn fabric of our society. So all four of us have a role to play. Media has uh, a bigger role to play. Government has even a big, even bigger role. And uh, if we all can come together, I think nothing is impossible. Why do you say the torn fabric of the society? Are you worried about the different uh, uh, communal overtones that's going on across the country at, yeah, from time to time? Uh, yeah, there are you know many issues. Uh, conflict means there is 
uh, and I mean the social fabric is already torn. That's what his conflict is all about. And to put an end to conflict, we all have to come together. And conflict means <laughs> today India has lots of conflict. It's not just insurgent conflict. See, it's, it's not, not just, just no, 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 no. It's a personal conflict. A, a, a person who has conflict within himself commits suicide, depression. These are all a big challenges that our society is facing now. And, uh, and we need to find solutions. And, and, and art and of living is providing solutions for this. And 65% of our population are around the age of 35, which is a huge demographic Roots. dividend. You, how do you channelize that into the right direction today? Yeah, that's all. That's what we have formed this. Uh, the art of living has many programs. We have 57 different programs to cater to the individual and company setup and society. And um, we have been fairly successful in uh, bringing back enthusiasm in the lives of people. Absolutely, Guruji, bringing back enthusiasm in the lives of people. And we hope you continue with your endeavor okay. and the people are with you. And with that, I think you have basically people Namaste. are your force multipliers. Thank you very Namaste. much for being Namaste. on my show. Namaste. It was a pleasure Namaste. having Namaste. you on my show. Thank you. <laughs>